Hi, y'all doing? How y'all doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful, my handsome Aries out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the parts that doesn't, what doesn't, leave it that shit on out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comment section pretending to be me, if my name is not highlighted, that is not me, okay? And I do not reach out first. But anyway... Aries, boo, there's a situation here. You're about to get a message. Somebody's about to contact your ass, okay? It is somebody that you're not expecting. For some of y'all, it's a flat-out Virgo that will be contacting you. Others of y'all, this is you're not going to expect this. And some of y'all, you might even ignore this person, or you might just, I'm, I'm, I'm getting a, you're going to leave them a doubt on, okay? Or you're just going to hang up the phone once you hear their fucking voice. Because for some of y'all, it's like, you don't want to hear this shit. You don't give a damn about somebody else's business. But here's the thing. With this person reaching out, this person here has been, they've been holding on to some type of information. They've been keeping to themselves is what I'm getting. They don't want nobody to know or it's like this was the perfect time in order to tell it or to get it out there is what I'm getting. Being real messy. But it's like somebody here tried to hold hold back from this for so long or what have you. Um, but they feel like they need to come towards you and tell you some type of information, okay? Somebody here is going through a major change within their life here. For some of y'all, this could be a feminine energy or a masculine energy. Something happened within a home dynamic, a home situation, okay? Some shit blew the fuck up is what I'm getting. And it's like this this Virgo is a part of, part of these people or affiliated with these individuals. And they know about it, okay? And this person feel like they need to come towards you and tell you for some reason. Um... For some of y'all, okay? It says poverty and false person. So maybe this is because spirit is letting you know that the messenger is coming through this person. The message is coming through this person. You may not like this person or what have you or whatever it is. Okay? But this person is going to tell you something about this person that did you dirty in your past. This person has lost a home, lost a vehicle, something of that nature. Something is like really fucked up in their life right now, okay? They could even be losing like everything. They could be out in the streets literally, okay? Is what I'm getting because they were being false here, whoever this person was. See this these ooh. Yeah, see, this person was working with someone else to do something. Okay, with the with the uh, page of coins here, something had potential here, but there was people here that was fighting over this. They was jealous over something, maybe an idea. I don't know, something here, but somebody here was fighting over something or was fighting over someone in particular or just simply you here, Aries. Or like, it was a topic of discussion within this dynamic, all right? And with the Ten of Swords, this shit has came to an end. World card came to a fucking end, okay? But I'm definitely getting there could be a Virgo masculine or Taurus or Capricorn that may be coming up to you and telling you something about these people, Okay? Yeah, we got the Nine of Cups and the Nine of Coins. Something here was going in, coming in very slowly. Okay, whatever you wish for, you prayed for, or prayed upon, or whatever like that, boo. It was like coming in a little bit slowly, and you couldn't figure out why. It's because of whatever was going on within the household. Maybe some of you, somebody was doing some, ki uh, whipping up some shit in the kitchen, or whatever like that, doing it, going crazy, over beyond doing some crazy shit, kitchen magic, or whatever like that. So God had to bring the whole foundation down. Uh, get the fuck out of the house, bitch, is what I'm getting, okay? But we got the hangman and the ten of, ten of coins. Somebody here is stuck in a relationship that they do not want to be in okay is what i'm getting first for some of y'all it's this false person others of y'all it's like these couldn't be family members here for some of y'all okay these family members are stuck and they need your help your assistance in some type of way it's like with the queen of coins it's like you are you're very established here Okay, and it's like leaving these people out in the cold and focusing on yourself. It's like you're able to like build some type of wealth or some type of saving or something of that nature. But there is people here. Ooh, they watching you. I'm getting Aries. These people are watching you. Okay, they're trying to figure out why you're not a victim to whatever they was they was doing behind the scenes. Okay, they're trying to figure out. Yeah, because you got God on your side. Period. Uh. Okay, this person is false. Whoever this bitch is is mistress. That's not like Sagittarius reading. That's crazy. But anyway, um, Ace of Swords. This is the truth. There is a Queen of Cups, a Cancer Prize, a Scorpio feminine energy that is lying. Okay? This person is lying. If this person comes towards you, if there's a water sign feminine energy that comes towards you, do not trust this bitch. What she got to say, she's fucking lying is the energy that I'm getting. Okay? This may have to do with a lover. Is So, y'all, y'all be, let's see. What else, spirit? What is this spirit? 
two of swords. Yeah, something is on delay. Something is stuck. Somebody needs to make a decision. What is this spirit? Yeah, about moving on from something with the six of swords. Somebody got to make a decision to move the fuck on. Okay, yeah, be strong. That's you. That's you, Aries. Okay? It's like you got to be strong, baby. All right? You got to stand in your power, honey. Don't let whatever information this is get to you, affect you in no type of way, baby, period, okay? Because this is what these people want you to do, especially when it comes to a lover. If you're no longer with this person and they, like, thought the grass was greener on the other side, they, they quickly figured out that it wasn't, okay? This bitch might be coming towards you because she want to tell you something about this masculine to make you feel some type of way about him so you won't want him. But in actuality, you never did want this person, especially if they got him. She got a little trash, the fuck? But anyway, so yeah, with the Wheel of Fortune, it's like you got a destiny. You got a purpose here, Aries, okay? You are highly protected with the Seven of Stars, honey. And I'm also seeing that there's someone here, like I said earlier, somebody could be coming towards you as well. It could be masculine energy. Okay, this person wants to definitely give you something, all right? Whoever this man is. What else? Oh, six of stabs. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Eight of stabs. Six of stabs. Somebody here is definitely very attracted to you. This could be a secret crush for some of y'all. This could be, a, or a cancer. Oh, sun card. Leo energy. Somebody just love the way that you shine and, and your, your, um, your energy. How you just full of life here. Okay, how you take no shit is what I'm getting. Somebody like that about you is what I'm getting, Aries. Oh, we got the three of cups. We got the two of cups and the three of stats. Somebody here that you can have distance with. I'm not getting an X energy, but somebody here. And it really go, you know what I'm saying? Um, the relationship didn't really go too far. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, this person is definitely in regret. They've been manifesting you. Whoever this individual is. Could be an Aquarius for some of y'all. Could be a Cancer. Yeah, page of cups. Somebody here want to apologize. Mm-hmm. But you and that Queen of Swords energy for some of y'all this could be your ex. Ooh. But you and that Queen of Swords energy, like, nah, get the fuck out of my face. Okay. Ooh, King of Cups. Who's this King of Cups? This could be a Cancer by uh Scorpio here. You can feel like this person has too many, like, you know, uh, messed up attachments or addictions. Alright. They need to go ahead and, you know, get that shit together. And it look like you're rejecting that person as well. Mmm. Yeah, cancer energy. Yeah, you're blocking these people out of your fucking energy. You don't want nothing to do with these people. You want a new beginning. That's just period with the Ace of Pentacles. All right. Yeah, you, you made your decision with the King of Swords. You're not playing no games here on these streets. All right. You don't want to hear no drama. You don't want to hear no bitch come to your fucking door. Call you about a nigga that you used to fuck with. You don't give a damn. Okay. Like, bitch, you got to go through all of that just because this nigga leaving you or don't want to be with you all. Get the fuck out of here. Don't nobody care. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But anyway, I'm going to end it right there, Aries. Okay. If you guys need anything else from me, look in the description box below. I love you guys. See you next time. Bye.